Hello everyone, this is Bukhari. Today I'm going to show you how to create beautiful triangles for our projects that we normally use in drop down menus. So I'm going to open Dreamweaver CS6. This is my code editor, and you can open your own code editor, no problem. In Dreamweaver CS6, file new create a new file give it a title copy this name triangles and save it in our form anything any name you want to save it that's up to you in the body tags present a few few times to make some space insert a div tag it is going to be a class and we're going to give it a name triangles triangle okay delete the text okay um, Copy this line, command C, paste it three times because we are going to create triangle and each triangle will be position in the four directions like left, right, top, down, bottom, like so. So give it a name triangle top triangle right triangle bottom triangle left press live in here we don't you see nothing in here yet because we haven't put any CSS style in there we're going to start it now after the title press enter a few times to make some space make some room it's so 30 CSS style tags in there style type text CSS close the tags CSS style tag in the middle this is our class this is a div class and this is the name of the class triangle top and so on so the class for the class we're going to give it a dot that's how the class starts in CSS and the name of the class copy this we're going to work with the triangle top first with a curl open curl bracket close curl bracket bracket we're going to give it a, a width zero pixel height would be same And we're going to add the border for the width and height. Border top. It is going to be 100 pixels solid. Uh, black. And I'm going to copy this. Come and see. Paste it three times because there is going to be four sides top right. Make sure you put the appropriate name and don't many don't make any mistakes in there and in the classes top right bottom. That's my son talking. In the behind is two, uh, is two and a half years old. Please ignore it. <coughs> Let's concentrate on the tutorial here. Bottom top, uh, right, bottom left. Okay, so far so good. Black, red, uh, green, 
we're, we're giving the four corners for color right so yeah. we press in here we will be seeing the rectangle in there so this is the rectangle and within this within the rectangle there are four triangles sitting in there touching each another right so this is the triangle rectangle and within the rectangle we have the triangles four triangles sitting in there so and this tutorial is about is this tutorial is about creating triangles so let's make the triangles okay um, now first first of all this is our class triangle top so we're going to create the top triangle this is the top side bottom side right side left side but the arrow is pointing to the right direction so you have to accept that that doesn't mean that this is the bottom or top this is the top top side of the rectangle so um so we're going to create the top triangle to do that to create the top triangle what we have to do is that we have to keep the bottom triangle off from the from here but before we would do that we need to copy this code paste it two more times because we want to create four triangles right so and we're going to change the name like this one is the top like this format top right bottom left we have created three uh, four classes div classes first one is here top second one is right uh, mommy? third one is bottom mommy? Mommy? and the fourth mommy? one is left yeah, so there we have our rectangle and within these four rectangles we have our triangles sitting in there now we are going to split everything from there so let's dive into it um, first of all this is the first one the top one we are going to create the uh, top triangle by first of all removing the removing the bottom border bottom properties from there okay we're almost there we still have the red red one red triangle and the yellow triangle with it we're simply going to give it a transparency red one and yellow one and that will do the job okay red side is gone copy this transparent code paste it in there so there we have it there is our top triangle is complete the triangle itself okay and let's work with the top triangle right triangle right one this one okay right side we want everything that we want to show that everything we're, we're going to keep it in here we're going to give it a black color so that we understand simply change the color so we're going to take this keep this one right and right triangle and because we want to keep the right triangle we will not be needing the left triangle so keep the left triangle off from there like so and simply give the red and green a transparent color let's refresh there is our right triangle now we're going to work in the triangle bottom that means the this one we're going to keep but we're going to color it black 
I'm just doing it because of the understanding. Everything is black where I'm going to take it, right? That's why I'm doing it. Okay. So we are going to take the bottom, keep the bottom triangle in here. So we have to take the top triangle out from there, out from there, by selecting the top border and remove it. That's it. Now we will just have to go to put the transparency on this yellow and red color. So there is our triangle button sitting there. Now we are going to work with the left one and in the left one we are going to give it a black color. So we're going to keep the black triangle in, in here and we that's why we won't need the opposite triangle. That would be the right one. Right one. So we take the right one off from there and refresh it. There we go. Uh, almost there. Uh, we just have to give the yellow and green a transparency color. Transparent color green and yellow. So folks, gentlemen this is how you create pixel perfect precise html and css based uh, triangles simply simply use this code that's it it's as simple as that it's very easy to understand very easy to make create simply these codes this is the top arrow code this is the right arrow code this is the um, bottom triangle code and this is the left triangle code. This is all our triangles, right? So we just created triangles from out of the rectangle. So and, and for your projects, you just simply have to minimize the decrease the size like 20 pixels each or depending on your needs, the size. I'm just doing it for the understanding. This is how you can make it even smaller, like five pixel. That would be tiny. There you go. That's too tiny. Maybe ten. Let's see. Yep. This is a uh, appropriate size, I guess, for the drop down, like like the arrow in here. You see, it's a little small. This is 10 pixel. Okay, to make this kind of arrow in there, you just have to put maybe six. That's too small, right? So, eight. You can play with the numbers. You know, it's it's up totally up to you, and you can simply change the color as you want that's it so this is how you create beautiful triangles using HTML and CSS it's simple very simple and easy to understand so hope it helps and I uh, hope it helps for your projects upcoming projects and please do share with others and if you like it and if it helps you and inspires you please do subscribe and do make comments on this and anything that you want to see in the future or how I can upgrade these and other things you know if you make comments that really inspires me whatever the comments is to make the make things for you guys and I learn I'm learning a lot from this so um, hopefully it helps you guys and please do share with others Thank you for watching my youtube channels and please do subscribe comments and do give it a thumbs up if it helps you and yeah this is it thank you very much for watching enjoy